Hello there, welcome back to my tutorial. First of all, this tutorial is made in Swift 4 on Xcode 9, but if you're still using Swift 3, then this code will work fine for you. So today we will be creating a barcode and QR code generator. So this is what we will be creating. So I will just enter link of my website. So I am yash.com. Okay, it's, I hate autocorrect. I am yash.com and I'll just generate a barcode. So here's the barcode for my uh, website. So if you uh, don't know how to like check this, just go on the App Store or Play Store, probably on the App Store, uh, get a QR code scanner or something and the, uh, just scan this code and you will see imyash.com as text. So let's generate a QR code and this is the QR code for the same. So this is what we will be creating. And uh, here I have already created a new project so first of all let's just turn me on uh do not disturb so it's on and just just check out my uh, weather in my city it's like minus two so winter is here anyways it's sick cool here and uh, i'll uh yeah and i will be fast forwarding this design part so just hang around and enjoy the music one two one two three Any for my thoughts you say You can keep the change If the truth or if they're fiction They're worth about the So same. I'm done with the designing part So let's uh, start with linking it uh, with our code file So first of all text field So I'll say data field For segment will be uh, Just say like code selector uh, image will be display code view and we need an action for our button so it will be let's say generate pressed and it will be action and of type UI button and hit connect so I'll get rid of this and uh, so we are done with the storyboard part so let's hop over to our view controller and let's start coding uh, okay i'll just make this good okay so some space at the bottom okay so first of all we need uh, text from our data field so let's say if let text equal to data field dot text so if we have text, then we will do it. So if uh, we are just pressing the button, uh, it won't work. Okay, now we have the text. Now we need to convert it to data. So it let data equal to text dot data and uh, using string encoding and allows lossy conversion. So encoding will be dot ASCII and allows lossy conver uh, conversion will be false. Okay, now we have the data. Now we need to create a filter. So let's say if code selector is equal equal to zero. So this means that if we have selected barcode, then what we will do. Now we need to create one more variable over here. So variable will be filter and it will be of type CI filter and exclamation. Exclamation mark means that we will definitely give it a value. So here filter will be filter uh equal to ci filter open brackets and it will be name and name will be first one was barcode so it will be ci code 128 bar code generator make sure you just copy it right i will just put this terms in the description so if you are like having trouble finding it just uh look in the description and here it will be code selector dot selected segment index and so if this then else uh, user has selected qr code so let's create filter for qr code filter is equal to ci filter open brackets name 
and this will be CI QR code generator and now we need to uh, set value for our filter so filter dot set value and value will be our data and for key will be uh, input message and this three terms you have to do it right okay otherwise it won't work so we are done with this filter thing I'll just center the screen um, uh, okay if you don't know how to center the screen it's control L that's how it works okay so let image equal to UI image open brackets and it will be of type CI image not CG image make sure you select CI image and CI image and just pass in here filter dot it will be output image and exclamation mark and just display this image so what we had okay it's display code view display code view dot image equal to image sorry so let's run this application and let's see what happens uh, this one is my previous app don't mind so our application is running right now so I'll just type in uh, my name so okay just type in my name bro why it's not working my keyboard is not working over here let's see if I can get okay it's here and I just say barcode and generate okay it generates a barcode let's say QR code it generates a QR code but uh, if you notice this code is like a bit blurry so let's fix that so stop the application and here uh, after filter dot set value say let transform equal to CG affine transform open brackets scale X and Y and uh, scale X will be 10 and scale Y will be 10 and we need to transform the image so output image dot transform and just pass in the transform over here and let's run it again I hope it works it will work I am the best so let's say I hope my keyboard works why why my keyboard is not working anyways I'll, I'll just try this okay and generate so this time barcode is much more clear and generate okay so you can play around with this numbers and suit yourself so basically this is how you create barcode and QR code this three part are uh, this three terms are most important so they will be in the description and as always project will be in the description as well if you want to like check it out or something anyways thank you guys uh, for watching if you like my video thumbs up if you have any question post it in the comments and don't forget to subscribe for future videos